A visit to the city of Cologne is not complete without learning about its aromatic namesake, which is why we stopped at the historic Fragrance Museum. Well, I'm dressed as Johann Maria Farina, and he's an Italian perfume maker. He came to Cologne and invented a very famous perfume, the Eau de Cologne. Oh, right now we are in the, well, in the home of Johann Maria Farina, where he invented, invented his Eau de, Eau de Cologne. This used to be the old factory, this whole place. Johann Farina had an absolute sense of smell, which means he could smell notes of a scent that most other people couldn't, and he could combine them in his head to create this perfect fragrance. He essentially was a composer of scent. Eau de Cologne is a light fragrance, composed of citrus fruits, bergamot, sandalwood, and a few other components, but the exact recipe remains a secret even today. When you come to the museum, uh, you, can, you have an opportunity to learn something about the history of Eau de Cologne, of Johann Maria Farina himself, and you can also see many of the things he used, and of course you can smell many uh, very interesting ingredients, and at the end you hopefully should have learned something about perfume. Uh, and of course we have a shop where you can buy the Eau de Cologne and all, also more modern perfume, all kind of interesting bottles and sorts. So I use perfume every day, but I never realized how complex it is to create a fragrance. And after coming here and learning about perfume making and its history, I'm going to appreciate my perfume that much more. And I'm definitely taking a little bit of cologne home with me.